All right, welcome everybody. Let's do a little late night ripping. We'll do the little flux a little bit later on. I got in the mood for football. Chunky one, I think. They're all uh, 15 card packs, but I'm guessing that first one's the chunky one. I'm gonna set that aside. Debo Samuel on the back there. Devin Singletary. I thought it was going to be Isaiah McKenzie. Because he just got traded. To, or no, he just got cut today. I don't think he got traded. I think he got cut. I'd cut him too after what he did to my fantasy league. It's like whenever I'd play him, he wouldn't do squat. Whenever I didn't play him, then he'd have a good game. Uh, Fletcher Cox. Nelson Aguilar. Mark Andrews. Uh, Brian Burns. Joey Bosa. Uh, Cameron Brake. Miles Garrett. Keem Hicks. Walter Jones. All right, Marquez Valdez Scantling. Jonathan Taylor. Damian Pierce is my rated rookie. I'll leave packs over there. I'll use this. Uh, Terrell Bernard. Buffalo Bills. Debo. Pretty nice looking card. It's got like that canvas texture to it. Uh, <laughs> I'll set him up here for now. I almost put that in a magnetic, but really, man, I'm got to cut back down, cut down on my magnetic uses. That gets really expensive, real quick. Wish I had the money to get the, uh, the like black uh, magnetics. Especially the ones that say like rookie card on. I think those would be cool. CJ Mosley. Uh, 
I'm really surprised with all the brands of top loaders there are that they all stick with the basic colors. It's like you think you think some of the new brands would branch out with like maybe orange. That way, you know, you'd have like University of Miami and you know a lot of you cover a lot of college teams too. You know, especially with the I don't know they're trying to push the popularity of college cards, but it's not there yet. But I mean, you know, and like Iowa Hawkeyes, you could have yellow ones. Daniel Jones, Tremaine Edmonds. Justin Simmons. Mike Williams. Marcus Davenport. David Njoku. Cooper Cup. Drew Locke. Uh, Michael Brockers. Ty Hilton. What do we got here? Man, we got bad corners, what we got. <laughs> that sucks. Like they saved it for the last two cards in the pack or whatever. Or last three, the, the nice cards. Let's just ding up the nice ones. Yeah, even the back one got it a little bit. Man. That's messed up. All the all the base cards look like they survived it. But my Trent McDuffie Ray rookie. You nailed me there. Discount. D'Angelo Malone. It's not terrible, but it's noticeable. But focus on the beauty of the card, so other than that. And other than the practice jerseys, I don't like that. Uh, Kenneth Walker. If you're going to do that, they should have like a little cheesy subset called like Practice Makes Perfect or something stupid. <laughs> All right. Red Hot Rookies. Kenneth Walker. Bad Corner. Man, that sucks. Try not to let it bother me. It's not that bad. Near Mint. Alright. Quit dwelling on that. On the next pack. Ooh, that feels like... Harder to tell once they get 15 cards in them. Let's skip to this pack. For some reason, I feel that that one's safer than this one. But same cut. Oh yeah, so we're gonna have a silver pack here. Another silver pack. Don Russ clearly. Alright, we'll save our silver pack for later. See, it still says 2022 NFL trading cards up there. I should just save that. I might save that pack. 
just mess with y'all. Can't tell them into. Justin Jefferson, Darius Slayton, Jordan Poyer. Oh man, I knew I forgot something. I took the time to put batteries in it too. I had another light to brighten up the situation. Zach Wilson. I guess I'll just have to wait. I don't think we're getting a pretty good picture anyway. Zach Wilson. Keenan Allen. Uh, did they say he's going to trade him? I almost thought he got, he might have got traded already. Or else there's just talks of him getting traded. I think he's free agent or something. That's what the deal is. I'll have to look that up. Well, there's... I still can't believe Ezekiel Elliott got let go. He's, to me, he should be a good running back. Cameron Jordan. He got, what, 12 touchdowns at least, just like a year ago? Not last year, I don't think, but I think the year before he did. Donovan Peoples-Jones. Yeah, I found out an interesting fact tonight, too. I was watching the old Pawn Stars, and uh, it was like, what league retired the uh, retired the first jersey, and uh, ended up being some guy on the Maple Leafs, I think it was, for hockey. That was the first professional sports jersey retired, or number retired. <clears throat> Albert. Oku Oku Ubanum. Something like that. We got Chris Carson. Jamal Williams. Michael Pittman Jr. Jake Plummer. Chris Olave. I got that nice little uh, the rookies card back there. Oh, we got another one. Something similar in here back here. Let's see what we got here. Kyle Gordon. Where did I put my rookies at? If I had a stack of one. Kyler Gordon. Ooh. The Dominators. Aaron Rodgers. Still haven't heard if he's on the Jets officially, but. Don't really care at this point. It's kind of like the old Brett Favre story. They just want you talking about him. It's almost a magnetic moment, but since he's keeping us waiting, I don't think it's really his decision right now. I think it's just, I think it's up to the Packers if they want some money for him. So, they want compensated. There we go. Baker Mayfield down Tampa Bay. That was pretty crazy. I don't know. It's kind of he's kind of a wild card. You could go either way on him. He could have a really good season. Maybe just a flash in the pan, or could be a dud. But I have a feeling he 
going to turn out a decent season. Just unexpected. And then they've made a few other changes. They got rid of uh, what, Leonard Fournier. Uh, and then somebody else, it seemed like. So we got Terry McLaurin. Bills just need a wide receiver to replace the, what, Isaiah McKenzie. Chiefs got rid of Juju Smith-Schuster, Joe Mixon, Trayvon Diggs, I just don't want Odell, I do not want Odell Beckham on the Chiefs, no thank you, Trayvon Diggs. Now I've seen where the Cowboys re-signed uh, Cooper Rush. I think that was a smart move for them. Josh Allen. Just to have, I mean, if the, if Dak gets hurt, I mean, they could still make it Super Bowl. With that guy, I think. And then you got Josh Allen. But they got to go through my Chiefs. All right, we got Devontae Williams. Ben Roethlisberger. Juju Smith-Schuster. I think he had, what, six or seven touchdowns this last year, so nothing to complain about, that's for certain. Unless, of course, you didn't play him on those weeks because they didn't know if he's going to play because Oh, <laughs> uh, Hubbard. Trying to keep myself edited a little bit. James Conner. Tony Bazzelli. Look going old school. Joe Montana, Dave Montgomery, Aiden Hutchinson. Oh, we got some more dinged up cards, and they just happen to be the insert cards again. Oh, <laughs> that's messed up. That's quality control there. That, that ain't bouncing around because that box wouldn't. And you don't hit only the Insert cards. Come on, man. What? That's messed up. David Long Jr. And David Owabo. I mean, this was a target box and all. I mean, it's got a little damage here. So, I mean, it took some impact, apparently, at one time. But, <laughs> to just... Hit the insert cards, not the base. Come on, man. Something's wrong. Craziness. All right. Man, we're down to the last pack already. We might have to open that silver pack. I almost made this live just to see who's awake out there. But then I don't want to get some weirdo. <laughs> you know? <laughs> uh, I don't Jim Kelly. Uh, where do I hear? Where do I want to put him at? Put him there. I'll show him again, though. In this case. Old Bill's Mafia cards is tuning in. Diami Brown. Uh, Damian Harris. Make sure he's paying attention. Kenny Golday. Tony Romo. Tony Romo. 
Thought he was drinking Coronas or something. John Elway answering the Corona hotline or something. Michael Vick. Hunter Renfro. Jeff Arkdula. Uh, Quentin Nelson. J.J. Watt. Man, what a tank. Yeah, why, why can't they put the uh, height and weight on there? Is that such a bad thing? Okay, here we go. We got some Nord dinged up cards, it looks like, coming up. Clavon Chisholm. George Kittle. Tyrone Davis Price. Christian Harris. Kid Reporter. First come, first serve, I imagine. Couldn't tell you because I doubt I'm eligible. All right. I don't want to save this. Eh, nah, we'll open it. Have a, not, nothing to brag about, really. Cause we didn't get our jersey card either, so maybe it's in here. Did I save that pack? Or? No, we already opened that one. Little something. Uh, Kenneth Gainwell. Dan Marino. Marquise Brown. Keenan Williams. Oh man. Poor <laughs> dinged up cards. Man, you really got to look over the box so well. Austin Eckler. I'm not sure that that's what did the damage to the cards, though. I just can't believe that it only damaged a few of them, not all of them. Chris Godwin. <laughs> Green Hunt. DJ Moore. Sean Alexander. Yeah, 112 touchdowns. I got tore it up. Devontae Adams. What's he up to? Yeah, he's only got 73, so he's got ways to go to catch up to good old Sean Alexander. Carson Wentz. Allen Robinson the second. Brian Robinson Jr. Who we got coming up there? Darren Stingley Jr. I think we got a fancy one here. Malik Willis. Hey, isn't he on the cover of a... Uh... Yeah, that's a neat looking card there. Yeah, it looks like it survived. It looks, looks like it's got good corners. Leak Willis. Isn't he on the cover of, uh... Yeah, Prism. Him and Derrick Henry. Yep, I'm sure of it. Wee, I think that's a good one. That deserves a magnetic moment, I think.
Excuse me. Ah. Is that nice? See, he's kind of going into the vortex, the time portal. Yeah, we'll do a little bedtime story for y'all. The Titans grabbed Willis with an eye on the future. That time might be sooner rather than later, thanks to the quarterback's drive for perfection. He's a very competitive player, and he's a guy that wants to pick it up, said offensive coordinator Todd Downing. He prides himself on not making the same mistake twice. Huh. Okay, I think I'll uh, go to bed. And uh, that way maybe I can get up and do a wake and break. Because if I do, if I continue right now, you might hear a few yawns out of me. And if we get any more ding cards, it might have give me nightmares. So I better just go to bed. <laughs> Let's go to bed and do a wake and break. That sounds fun. Alright. Cool. Y'all have a good night. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you come back later in the day. After I get the wake and break uploaded. Check it out. And in the meantime, check this one out if you haven't checked it out already. And, uh. Yeah. I'm going to sign out before I pass out. Talk to you all later. Good night.